right, hello, wine drinking people. Today is Friday, February 8th, and just rolling along here in the month of February. A lot of great events drinking champagne tonight with Pinot Noir. It's getting close to Valentine's Day. It's our annual champagne Pinot Noir tasting here at the Wine Watch, but a lot of great events coming up for you, our wine drinking people, next week. One of which is a once in a lifetime event. This event has been on the calendar for the last six months. Over a thousand people have viewed our page on our website on this. As Chateau Lafitte Rothschild gets a lot of attention today. This uh, great chateau was voted first to first in the 1855 classification. Maybe that's why it sold for so much in 1866 when the Rothschild family bought this property. It sold for 4.4 million francs, which may not seem like a lot of money today, but uh, because I think they just estimated it's worth at $4 billion dollars. Which is crazy because uh, they make like you know thirty thousand cases of wine. I don't know. In our review, it says twenty thousand. Very secretive about the number of actual number of cases produced at some of these chateaus. But uh, a lot of people don't realize back in eighteen fifty five they didn't classify the dirt. They actually classified the chateau. So Chateau Lafitte Rothschild. Well, it could be uh, they could have added I don't know how many acres on since the original classification. But today rumor has it they produce upwards of thirty thousand cases of the first growth alone. And, uh, man, that is a ton of wine at this quality level. You have seen Chateau Lafitte Rothschild reach 100 points on many occasions by Robert Parker Jr. We, we're going to be serving one of them this evening, the 2003, one of the 100-point Chateau Lafitte Rothschilds. And this estate's history goes back further than that into the 18th century. The Marquis de Segur that also owned Mouton Latour and Colon Segur owned this great property. And, uh, well, it was aux- it was sold to the Rothschild family, thus becoming Chateau Lafitte Rothschild uh, just after the 1855 classification. And like I said, it was voted first to first and, you know, still considered for many years to be one of the greatest uh, chateaus of Bordeaux. And shortly after the sale to the Rothschilds, they held an auction in the 1811. Uh, Chateau Lafitte sold for a ridiculous amount, the most amount ever paid for a bottle of wine at that time. The 18 1982 vintage... Just a few years ago in Hong Kong, sold for $10,000 a bottle. Yes, that's right, folks. If you bought that wine on Futures uh, when it came out in 1985 for $50, it sold it for $10,000 a few years ago. It's still hovering at around three to $4,000 today, the 82 vintage of Lafitte. And although we're not serving that tonight, we have 10 vintages of Chateau Lafitte on the table including, well, to start now with the Baron de Rothschild's Champagne, the newest thing, the three branches of the Rothschild family, Philippine de Rothschild from Mouton Rothschild, Eric de Rothschild from Chateau Lafitte Rothschild, who took over in 1975. And uh, that's when a lot of people feel like the renaissance at Chateau Lafitte uh, began, the new renaissance. And then uh, also um, Benjamin de Rothschild from Chateau Clark, the three uh, members of this family, the three sides of this family, have come together to produce a champagne. That's right, folks. They don't make sparkling wine in Bordeaux, so they figured we need to have our own champagne house. Why not? We have everything else. So we are going to be previewing to you, our wine-drinking people, at our Chateau Lafitte. What, what, what a better thing to open with than the Lafitte Rothschild, the Rothschild family sparkling wine, the Barons de Rothschild. Anyways, check it out. It's an order off the menu dinner, so we're going to be having a few small courses. Chef Oliver Saucy will send out, and then we will proceed to drink 10 vintages of Chateau Lafitte. We're going to have some great vintages on the, t- on the table, the 71, the 76, 83, 85, uh, 1998, a 98-pointer, 1999, 01, and the 03 vintage. Check it out. And we've got 24 different Chateau items from Chateau Lafitte in the store going back to 1957 on this offering. Check it out. I'm your host, Andrew Lampasoni, signing off for the Wine Watch, saying remember, always drink the good stuff first.